Hey, this is Brett, and this 2013 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sport is stock number 22J63A. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. This 2013 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sport has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. This Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop as a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this Jeep is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up, and take a look under the hood. Bright white, clear coat is the color, and I shoot all my videos in 4K, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, smartphone, or television, I highly recommend turning them on right now because it is your best way to check out the quality, condition, options, and cleanliness of the vehicle before seeing it in person. And if you like the video and how I do things here at Summit Automotive, consider clicking the subscribe button to my YouTube channel in the lower right-hand part of the screen. This one has the 17-inch painted silver alloy rims and it has Nexen Rodian AT tires. These are P25575 R17s. They have a really good amount of tread left. I would say probably 60 to 70% of the tread left on those tires. This front fender is in really nice condition and I didn't see any dents or dings on the metal part of the fender there. The front bumper is in nice shape. It does have the factory fog lights, the tow hooks, um, maybe just a little bit of a nick there, but nothing too bad. The front grille is in nice shape as well. And the hood is in really nice condition too. The only thing I saw is maybe one tiny little ding on the hood there, but other than that, very nice. Passenger side front fender looks really good and the passenger side rim is in nice shape as well. No scuffs or scrapes. Now as you go down this side of this 2013 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited, take note of how clean the body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, you can still see the Jeep, hear the Jeep and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises. And you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. And if this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you back rims in nice shape. And the back tires have just about as, <clears throat> excuse me, just about as much tread as the front tires. Frame and underbody back here looks pretty good. Just a little bit of surface corrosion on there, but actually not too bad for a 2013. Does come with the factory step bars and the lower rockers all look really good. The door hinges are in nice shape. Um, no major corrosion on them. Look pretty good. You always want to check those out. If you ever wanted to figure out how to take your doors off, I got a video in the upper right hand part of the screen showing you how to take your uh, door hinges off your Wrangler JK. So click that and check us out there. Rear bumper is in nice shape. The back spare is in nice shape as well and that back tire is brand new. Back storage area is very clean as well. Those seats do fold down for extra storage. I'll show you that how that works in just a minute. Uh, you got all your rooftop bolts. There's four on each side, three on the bottom, one on the top. You can take that hard top off. There are uh, two quick disconnects there. And I actually have a video showing you how to take your JK hardtop off, and that's in the upper right-hand part of the screen if you want to check that out. You do get a storage bin back here, and you also get spots for your roof and door hinge bolts. But very nice and clean. This back door is in nice shape as well. And that door shuts nice and smoothly and solidly. The hard top is in nice shape too on this side and coming around the driver's side just as clean as that passenger side. Rear quarter looks really good and for full disclosure this back rim is in fantastic condition too. Down the rest of the side of the Jeep the doors look really good. Hinges look pretty good on this side as well. Inside the sport package gives you the black cloth interior. 
There are no rips, there are no tears on the seats. I don't think this Wrangler's ever been smoked in. You do get the driver's seat height adjuster, factory floor mats, and those are in really nice shape other than my shoe prints there. Um, power locks, power windows. We'll take a quick look at the back seats. Back seats are just as nice as the front seats, no rips or tears back here. You do get the latch child safety system. You can see that that hard top is in really nice clean condition. And these seats do fold down for extra storage and you can see just how nice and flat that those go. They'd actually go down a little bit more flat if I had that front seat up a little bit more. Factory floor mats back here. And you do get child safety locks on the back doors and the bottoms of the doors all look really good. That door shuts nice and smoothly. And we'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this Jeep has to offer on the interior. You can see that this one has 65,957 miles on it. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean. You do get a compass and outside temp display there. Cruise controls and information center controls. You also have your mileage, uh, miles per gallon information on there as well. And uh, also the time. You also get audio controls in the back. It does have CD player, AM, FM, and Sirius satellite radio capabilities, power windows, climate control, stability control, downhill assist control, that's your hazard lights, mirror control, five-speed automatic transmission, and your 4x4 shifter. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition, no rips or tears on there, and the front top pieces are in fantastic condition as well. You do get an auto dimming mirror on this Wrangler, and we'll start it up and take a look under the hood. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. You do get heated power mirrors. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality and condition of this Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sport JK. Under the hood, you have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this Jeep is 100% ready to go. There's your emissions sticker. Very clean under here. And for being a 2013, I would highly recommend this Wrangler from a quality and condition standpoint. And to see more pictures of this Jeep Wrangler or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Wrangler videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our uh, hard top or door removal videos in the lower right. Actually, I'm going to put the uh, other one in the upper right. So click those, check us out, and uh, we're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2013 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sport in bright white. Thanks for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.